With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. And the question is, if ABC are in AP as well as in GP, then. Now, if we take this, given that ABC are in AP and also ABC are in GP. So, as ABC are in AP, so we can write B is equals to A plus C by 2. And as ABC are in GP, so we can write B square is equals to A C. Now, putting value of B in this equation, we get we have B square is equals to A C. Now, putting value, we get A plus C by 2 square is equals to A C. Or this will be a plus c to the whole square a plus c to the whole square is equals to 2 square will be 4 so and this 4 will be transferred here so it will be 4 ac here now this will be equal to a square plus c square plus 2 ac minus 4 ac is equals to 0 or we have a square plus c square minus 2 ac is equals to 0 now we know a formula a minus b to the whole square is equals to a square plus b square minus 2ab. So, applying that formula here, we can write this will be equal to a minus c to the whole square is equals to 0. Or we can write a minus c will be equals to 0. Or this will give us a is equals to c. We have the equation b square is equals to ac as a, b, c are in gp all, also. So, putting it in here, we get b square is equals to a and c are equal. So, we can write c as a and we get a square here. So, from this, we get a is equals to b. Now, we get a is equals to b and also we have a is equals to c. So, we can write that from here that a will be equal to b will be equal to c. So, the answer of this question is if a, b, c are in a, p as well as in g, p then a will be equal to b and b will be equal to c. That is three of these are equal. So, option d is correct option. Thanks for watching. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.